Hey Bromley residents, welcome back to another week of our Guide to Life at Brom series. This week I'm excited to talk to you guys about how to make a staycation here at Bromley since there's no official spring break. Um, but first, let's get started with some updates. So first for our COVID updates, so please remember to continue getting tested regularly, social distancing, wearing a mask, regardless of if you had the vaccine or not, you need to do these things. Also, please make sure to continue to be safe when you're out and about and being social. Um, St. Patrick's Day is coming up. There's going to be warmer weather, so we know that you're all going to be out and having a good time, but please be safe, be careful, um, stay in, do something fun here. Now for our Bromley updates, so please make sure that you check your email. The March newsletter was just sent to you guys. There's a lot of important information in there. There's also a survey for you to fill out where you'll have a chance to win some prizes, including a $100 gift card, so definitely make sure you check that out. One important update you will see in there is that our policy has changed and you are now allowed to have other Bromley residents in your room. There are still no outside guests allowed, but each occupant of a room can have one guest. So make sure you guys enjoy that. As always, make sure you keep an eye out for events here in Bromley, whether it be on your floor, hall-wide, dining hall dinners. Um, we are looking forward to having more of those in March. We had some great ones in February. Uh, first, we have our St. Patrick's lunch on March 17th with corned beef and cabbage, so make sure you check that one out. And keep an eye out for a message from your RA for your floor event. Now for our topic for the week. Just like you guys, we are so bummed that we can't have a spring break this year. So we wanted to help you guys out and give you some tips for how to make a staycation um, or a mental vacation here at Bromley. And we know you might need to de-stress and have some fun. So we've got some tips and ideas for that today. Okay, the first way you can enjoy a staycation here at Bromley is to take advantage of the Mez patio or you could always head to the pool patio um I don't know maybe you want to lay out or personally I think it'd be great to like bring some Mexican or like a smoothie out here and just think of warmer days in a warmer place my next idea for a staycation here at Bromley Hall is to take advantage of our pool amenity go ahead and book it um have some fun what's more spring break than swimming Okay, hear me out. Next stop on our staycation, head down to the fitness center, book yourself a slot, and get on that bike. Um, one of my favorite things to do on spring break is to go on a bike ride or work out um, outside and enjoy the nice weather. Also, you could always go outside for a walk or something. You could also book our community kitchen and make yourself a nice dinner. Treat yourself like you are on vacation. You deserve it. Help yourself de-stress with some good food. Okay, my final idea for a staycation here in Bromley um, during our spring break this year is to give yourself a spa night, uh, treat yourself. For me, this means some face masks, some chocolate, ice cream, junk food, whatever, and some relaxing music. So whatever it may be for you, treat yourself. This year has been challenging for all of us at some time, so make sure that you give yourselves a break. We are so proud of you for handling it. Thank you guys for tagging along for another episode of our Guide to Life at Brahm series. Um, your video pick of the week, I have not seen this one, but it has great reviews. It is Barb and Star go to Visa Del Mar. Um, it's kind of got that spring break theme, so check that one out. I'll be checking it out too. We will see what we think. Um, I hope you guys have a great week and take advantage of the tips we gave you in this video and enjoy the warm weather.